Aloha everyone, Darren Fryer here coming at you guys from Maui, Hawaii. Happy Wednesday. Hope you guys are all having an amazing midweek. I know it's been a long time since I've been on Facebook Live, Instagram Live, any of these live streams, but I'm really excited to jump back into it and to officially kick things off with this live. Um, I have my friend Isaac um, who should be tapping in here and I'll be inviting him up and you know we'll get straight into it. Um, you know, I got to actually meet up with Isaac in person for the first time, I believe. We've known each other online for a very long time, but you know, I was just in Arizona and I got to catch up with him at Whole Foods right before I had to race to the airport to catch my flight back to Hawaii. And let's just say we had some really powerful conversations. Um, you know, the world is in a very interesting state. Mental and physical health is at an all time low. And, you know, I think the topic we're going to be talking about in this live is going to be incredibly relevant to everyone. So let me just see when he jumps in, I should be able to invite him. Let me just search him. And yeah, guys, um, you know, there's some articles that have been coming out that have been really disturbing. You know, the first one, which I think came out earlier this year, was on how they're finding microplastics in the human bloodstream. And a lot of you know, I've been a promoter and a drinker of Kangen water for a long time. Got my Kangen water right here, and it's yellow because I got the turmeric ukon tea. So you know, it's not yellow just because it's plain Kangen water. It's got some ukon turmeric tea. Um, but yeah, let's see, I'm gonna add Isaac. An invitation. Micro microplastics in the bloodstream, which of course, Kangen water and zero waste hydrogen rich water machines are a big solution. And the next article that really rubbed me the wrong way was that they're finding glyphosate, you know, an herbicide from Monsanto in urine samples of over 80% of US citizens. Hey, what's up, Isaac? Good to see you, bro. Great to see you again. Good to see you. Hold on. Can you hear me good? I can. Can you hear me? Yes. Sounds good. Uh, continue what you were saying, though. Go ahead. Actually, let me see how I can make it a little louder. I, I can hear you, but it sounds quiet on my end. I'm not sure if it'll be like that. Maybe your is your mic covered or something? Uh, one second. Because I can kind of hear you, but it's muffled. So I just want to make sure everyone else can hear you clear. And Let's see. Sure, if I have to put mine on speaker. How about now? From... Is that better? Here, let me put on my uh, let me put on my headphones. Yeah, maybe no I'll worries. put I'll my, my headphones, my headphones and that'll be better. As well. Yeah. <laughs> right on. What's up, Joe? Thanks for tapping in, bro. Hey, I think it sounds. All right, is that better? Louder. Yeah, sounds better. Nice. Good. Yeah, man, just continue. Yeah, so I was just kind of going into, you know, the state of the world, uh, mental health, physical health, you know, with everything that's been happening with media and, you know, COVID and stuff, mental and physical health is at an all time low. There's research finally coming out, finding microplastics in our bloodstream, you know, literally herbicides in our urine samples. And, you know, there's not a lot of solutions I've seen in terms of cleansing the body of things like glyphosate, you know, which I know is really toxic to let it remain in your bloodstream. And yeah, I'm just glad that we got to meet up while I was in Arizona. I got to catch you at Whole Foods before my flight. And, you know, it was awesome, man. I've seen your journey and I've been watching your transformation. And dude, you've been getting younger and healthier every single day since, you know, probably two, three years ago when we first connected, maybe even longer, five plus years ago since we yeah. connected online. Um, no, I'm always one to learn from people who have the results I want, you know, people who are actually living and embodying a healthy lifestyle that I've seen with their progression and evolution. And yeah, you've, you've been killing it, man, especially with the CMOS and everything you put me on to a lot of health hacks and yeah, I'm, I'm excited to, you know, do this unboxing for the ultimate health health hack that you and Ian have really just put me on to the last few weeks. So yeah, man, stoked to have you on here. Thanks for tapping in. Honestly, Darren, it's my pleasure, dude. Thanks for having me. Um, and it's just what a fortunate turn of events that this has become. Really, man, I wanted to hang out with you at Whole Foods to talk crypto market, NFTs, you know, go over that whole stuff. And then we just started talking Perium a little bit here and there. And boom, here we are. Um, and, you know, obviously very excited about chilling chameleons and NFTs and the crypto market and all that coming forward. But here's the beautiful part about that. 
is everything that Perium does is very much so in alignment with that same ecologically conscious entrepreneurship um, type of lifestyle that you're living. And, you know, Chilling Chameleons being one of the most ecologically conscious NFTs that's available in the marketplace, you know, Perium is right there with that. As far as when, when we're talking about whole food supplements, you're seeing the packaging right there, that Terra packaging made out of bamboo and hemp, no plastics in the company anymore, no longer, I believe it's 99% of the products yeah. now are plastic free with the Terra packaging, bamboo and hemp packaging. That's powerful, man, because you're talking about microplastics in our blood. Obviously a large part of that we know is bottled water but not just bottled water, all these other bottled drinks, you know, if these bottled drinks aren't BPA free, you know, what do we think happens to this plastic when it's sitting in heat in a truck or in a plane, you know, whatever, you know, so um, it's really just, uh, it, it's all synergistically aligned. And like I said to you, bro, um, the stars have aligned for this partnership. Yeah. And I'm really excited for where it's going to go and proud of you for taking the step to get the glyphosate out of your system, to address possible heavy metals, uh, to address uh, possible parasites as well. Honestly, the, the story goes, the saying goes, if you have a pulse, you have a parasite. Why? Because when we're not in control of all of our food, we get exposed to the elements. And when we get exposed to the elements, you know, we don't know the cleanliness of that water. We don't know the cleanliness of that produce that was unwashed. We don't know the cleanliness of that soil you know there's so many factors as to how easily these things can find their way into our bloodstream and into our body and then cause a dam in our river so really just hats off to you man to uh you know making that step to uh, get all these things out of your system and allow your river to be flowing properly yeah appreciate it man i mean you're definitely a huge part of the inspiration last night i watched a pretty eye-opening documentary it's called beyond impossible and it goes into mm. you know the corruption of the fake meat industry and how it's literally it's like ultra processed starches <sighs> gmo grown starches from china and you know a lot of food and a lot of veganism is being hijacked as business you know and that's why we see some of the most corrupt evil meat companies now stepping in because it's technology, it's food technology, which is it's really scary what we're stepping into, you know, foods that didn't exist 50 plus years ago that they're trying to get us to eat as the new normal, when in reality, the new normal should be going back to the roots of what our great grandparents and great great grandparents ate, which everything was organic, everything was whole foods, people were growing farms and not lawns, and they weren't using things like Monsanto, you know, Roundup products that didn't even exist back then. So you know, world's at a very crazy state. And I think it's important for us to get back to our roots. And, you know, health is the mm. most important thing. You know, I'm, I'm very passionate about ocean conservation. But at the end of the day, we need these ocean conservationists to conserve their own well being and bodies, you know, because we want everyone, especially those who care for the planet, to care for their own health as well. So they could be on the planet longer, making an impact, creating influence and paying it forward. So yeah, it's, just crazy what the world's gotten into, man. When I was first getting into veganism, you know, I was raw vegan, vegan, and it slowly transitioned to where there was just unhealthy vegan junk food became the normal. And I just feel like it's, it's a toxic trap and it's more of a culture that people are tapping into without even joining it for the right reasons. So, you know, to make health convenient, you know, is the biggest thing. And, and that's the trap that I got into with being an unhealthy processed vegan, which made me not even want to be vegan anymore. I've been just stemming towards eating things from local farms and, you know, farm to table and whole foods, organic plant-based diet. But I feel like a lot of the world, you know, they're stuck in a situation where they can only go to the grocery store and buy what's being imported, you know, and a lot of this stuff, unfortunately, is being transported around the world. A lot of petroleum goes into it. And of course, you know, it's packaged in plastic packaging, you know, which leaches into these products. So, yeah, I'm super excited. I got my Purium uh, Ultimate Transformation Kit. It literally felt like Christmas yesterday. I don't think I've been this excited to receive physical products in a long time. Um, you know, especially nice, with crypto man. and Web3, I feel like a lot of people got so 
focus only on crypto, only on the metaverse. I mean, we can't forget our physical bodies and our physical universes. Like at the end of the, the day, universe. <laughs> you, you can have a lot of Bitcoin and it's, an, it's a valuable asset, but your physical health and well-being is your most valuable at the end of the day. You can't spend any of those cryptos. You can't even go on there and sell your NFTs for profits if you don't have your physical well-being, mental well-being at an mm. all-time high. So, mm. you know, there's really no bear market with health it's it's you should always be bullish on your health because mm. you know each individual is in control of every decision they make and yeah. yeah i wanted to just kind of do an unboxing on live that's why i was glad that you were available to come on and share some insight i'm still learning a lot about these products but you know i kind of kicked my day off with some amino 23s and some biomedics so i did kind of open a little bit of the packaging but i wanted to leave the rest to you know let ig let facebook live really experience it so, oh, nice man here. yeah yeah please uh please unbox and we'll go over it all and and you really hit a great point right there darren talking about you can have all the nfts and all the bitcoin and all the money and all that but yo if you don't have the health or the energy or the vitality to experience what money can buy none of that stuff matters yeah because what's life about what's life about it's about experiences and we can pay to have amazing experiences, but if you don't have the vitality to go through that experience with the best of you available, what does it matter? Yeah. Health, health is well. And one thing really that always that, resonated bro. with me too is that one saying, an ounce of prevention is worth more than a pound of cure. Mm. And you know, that's what so many people, you know, they're putting off prevention and just figuring if they make enough money, they can, buy the cure down the line and unfortunately that's not even the case sometimes you can't even buy the cure no matter how much money you have and that's even what mm. jonathan amaret said ask steve jobs if all the money in the world he made with apple could buy him his health back you can't because he wasn't able mm. to buy his health back after he sacrificed it for building apple and making money you know he put off prevention and he couldn't even uh, all the money in the world he couldn't buy you know back a cure so the Absolutely. first product that I'm super excited for, this is the first thing I'm starting my day with, taking a bunch before the gym, is Super Amino 23. Um, this is something I've definitely heard insanely good things about, watching all the testimonies of people on YouTube. I mean, you know, this is going to be a powerful product for my transformation, just really committing to plant-based and being able to stay athletic, stay in the gym and focus on my, my goals as a skimboarder. You know, this is a product that I'm super excited to have. So I know you have some really good things to say about it if you can kind of tap in about Super Amino 23. So crazy thing to say about that product right there is actually that product right there gave me my vision back. There was a certain few um, amino acids that apparently I was missing um, and I didn't even know about it. And I wasn't aware of it until I started taking Super Amino 23 where my vision just became clearer. I got all this focus back that I didn't even notice that I was missing. And it's because I was missing certain aminos in my lifestyle where I wasn't dotting all my I's and crossing all my T's. And so it was affecting my vision. And so Super Amino 23 not only helped my vision, but it insanely helped me with recovery, right? As an athlete, what's it about? Recovery. Yeah. You want to be able to recover as fast as possible so that you can get back out there and do what you love doing in the athletics, um, whatever that, those athletics may be. But if you're having a hard time rebuilding those muscle tissues that you just now broke down in those athletics, you're going to have a hard time going back out there to perform again. Well, Super Amino 23 is 99% pre-digested vegan protein that goes straight to the muscles in 23 minutes. No digestion needs to take place. No meta metabolic process. None of that stuff. It goes straight to the bloodstream in 23 minutes to the tissue cells that need it. It knows where it's needed and it goes straight to those tissue cells. I like to say it like this. Super Amino 23 is going to give you a pump without you having gone and done the pump. Yeah. If that makes sense. Because it's going to fill your bloodstream with those amino acids already. Now, of course, you want to go work out and you want to go build on top of that pump. But it's going to give you that pump regardless. Improve skin elasticity. If you're missing amino acids that's causing you to have a little bit of brain fog, it can help you with brain, with brain fog, with mental clarity, with um, you know, protein assimilation. Here's another thing. 
let's say you have a uh, 20 gram protein steak, right? Hypothetically, you know, uh, let's say you have a 20 gram protein steak. Well, you're probably only going to digest, metabolize and assimilate about five of those grams, about five grams yeah. from that 20 gram protein steak. Then you're thinking about, okay, well, this cow died. Um, so I had to take the life of this cow. And I'm only getting about 25% of the protein that I just now ate. And then the rest is going to be toxic waste. And I'm just, you're just going to, you're going to poop out the rest. <laughs> yeah. You know, one of the great Native American proverbs that's really impacted me in my life has been take only what you need and leave the rest. Well, if we don't need to take the life of someone else or of another sentient being for our amino acids, then we shouldn't have to. Well, Super Amino 23 can guarantee you, if you're looking to go plant-based, do a cleanse, do a raw whole food cleanse, but you're worried about your protein and the time, time frame, Dave Sandoval, the product formulator of Perium, is an absolute genius for creating Super Amino 23. That product right there is easily one of my top three favorite products in all of Perium because of how it's helped my vision, how it's helped my recovery. It helped me get rid of hypertension. I'm also a biker. Guys, I put 5,000 miles on my bike in six months. I have never recovered faster from biking than I have with Super Amino 23. Yeah. I work out four times a week, Super Amino 23. It's it. Oh, also, I practice intermittent fasting. Well, you can have Super Amino 23 while you're fasting because there's no digestion that needs to take place. No metabolic process. It just goes straight to the bloodstream. It's really like a cheat code. Yeah. Like on earth, on earth, when it comes to protein assimilation, Super Amino 23 is the greatest cheat code that I know of. Yeah, no, if I If there agree. was a better one, I'd be consuming it. I see you, I see Ian, and I see a lot of really high level vegan athletes, you know, doing amazing and thriving. And, you know, I've, I've been vegan and I feel like eating the junk food vegan diet, it made me frail, it made me unhealthy, it was just all carbs. You know, I've even done juice cleanses where it's hard because I just feel my muscles getting eaten alive because I'm not getting any mm. protein, even though I'm getting a mm. lot of nutrients. And yeah, it's, it's a true blessing. I think even the only plastic that even came in the, in the entire box is these three super amino packages and yep. maybe the little bit of plastic around, you know, this little measuring tape. But everything else that it came in is, you know, completely biodegradable, you know, plastic free packaging. So it's cool out of an entire box. This is like all the plastic that came in it. And of course, it's a very important product. So you know, I'd want it to be stored properly. But yeah, Perium is just absolutely killing it. And let's see, they got this awesome stainless steel shaker cup. You know, a lot of the shaker cups I've received and I've gotten are these nasty plastic ones that, you know, they just don't last that long and they get gross. They even got the stainless steel measuring cups. And I think this is the last yeah. piece of plastic they had in the packaging is this little zip tie. Yeah. And yeah, everything yeah. else is straight up. God, you're so conscious packaging. of all the plastic stuff, dude. I love it. What's up, Kwani? Welcome to the live. Yeah, so the next product, I'm probably going to take some of this before I go to the gym after this live. Some more Amino mm -hmm. 23s, some Can't Beat This, which, you know, Ian's been really hyping me up on this. I'm, I'm stoked to really try it out. Replace pre-workouts that are just filled with chemicals that you can't even really understand any of the ingredients. Tons and tons of caffeine, um, you know, even coffee in the morning. Like, this is going to be my replacement for all of it. So, yeah, how, how's your experience been with Can't Beat This? Well, my experience has been amazing. Um, the thing is, you're only getting 25 milligrams of green tea caffeine and a large serving of that. Well, how can you get the, only that much caffeine but still consider it a pre-workout? Because of the organic beet juice powder in there, multiplied by the adaptogens like ginseng, the yerba santa, and I believe there's one more, uh, rhodiola rosea in there. There's another adaptogen in there that's not going to tax your glands. You see so many of these pre-workouts out there, coffee, there's moringa in, moringa's well. in there as well. Um, like, like root, coffee. Siberian ginseng, yeah, there's a lot of good stuff. Yep. Most of these things end up taxing our glands. And then when it's taxing our glands, it's taxing our, our hormones, which is taxing our endurance, which is taxing our explosion, taxing our creative ability, taxing our mood, taxing everything. 
Why? Just because we want a short jolt of energy? It doesn't need to be like that. You know, we didn't used to need to drown ourselves in caffeine and such acidic lifestyles for us to have energy. We don't have to have this trade. You know, energy doesn't have to be this uphill battle that we're just constantly trying to go uphill as well as trying to fit a round peg in a square hole. It doesn't need to be like that. For every problem that's been created out there by man, nature has an organic, natural, nature, natural solution provided. We just got to go to nature yeah, and go plug in in that way. So, uh, yeah, man, can't beat this. This is going to come through with that vasodilation. It's going to give you a great pump. Again, another pump without getting that pump. And then when you go and do lift, you're going to feel it in your bloodstream. You're going to feel it in your veins. You're going to feel energetic but not like haywire. And then you're not going to have that crazy hard crash afterwards either because of the adaptogens in there. Real quick, dude, can you go into this packaging? Because this is so surreal, the fact that they got this bio packaging. It's made from hemp and bamboo, and it's compostable. That's Exactly. So cool. I mean, that's it right there, bro. Hemp, hemp and bamboo. You know, we call it Terra packaging. Um, Dave Sandoval is, if you guys don't know who this guy is, you will. But he is truly a pioneer in the ecologically conscious entrepreneur space. Um, and him being the product formula of all Perium products, um, it was really his idea for the Terra packaging. And he's just really, he's setting the pace, man. He's setting the pace, not just in the networking space, but in the supplement yeah. industry. It's in the it's supplement industry to be like, plastic free. All the pre workouts, even all the protein powders I've gotten, like there's the organic vegan ones from Costco, they come in these giant plastic tubs. And every 30 days, you're supposed to just get another giant plastic tub. Like, I don't even want to think about how much plastic I've, you know, created and thrown away over the last 10, 15 years of just pre workout like bottles and giant protein tubs and all that stuff. I mean, there's so much that goes into it when you know, companies could have been using stuff like this. So it, it's incredible that, you know, he's pioneering that. So yeah, also Absolutely, next up, man. we got the MVP Sport. These are the performance proteins. So yeah, super mm. excited to try these flavors out. Of course, they're packaged in the hemp bamboo packaging. And yeah, this stuff is going to be amazing. I can't wait to earn one of these shapes, you know, after a solid workout. Absolutely, bro. Absolutely. And also the power yeah, shake. So, so could you kind of explain the difference between the power shake and the MVP sport shake? Because I got two MVP sports and oh man, I'm so excited. I got four power shake bags. I mean, these are full on meal replacements. So, you know, buying this product wasn't even just spending unnecessary money. It was a transfer of dollars, you know, of me having to go spend time, spend money at a grocery store or eating out or, you know, all of that. I was able to simply buy this and now I'm good for, you know, breakfast and lunch pretty much for the next 30 days that I don't have Minimum. to spend time and money and I'm getting the best, most convenient, healthy whole foods that I can put into my body. You know, they say, Fast food isn't good for you, but when it's fast food with Purium, you know, it's the exact mm. opposite. And I love the convenience factor. But yeah, could you dive in a little bit on these two products? Absolutely, bro. Um, and you know, they do serve different pur pur bleh. They do serve different purposes. One is supposed to nourish your cells in the power shake and help you build your hermetic fit level, help you build your hemoglobin level. And then another one is gonna help you build your muscles. Well, the beautiful thing about MVP Sport is it comes with probiotics infused. It comes with enzymes infused. It also comes with adaptogens infused. Why is a certain food called an adaptogen? It's called an adaptogen because it adapts to your body's needs. And so because of the adaptogens infused into the MVP Sport, it's going to send that protein where your body needs it. It's going to send those calories where your body needs it. Also, this is the least chalky, uh, I don't know if I said that correctly, least yeah. chalky uh, plant protein I've ever had out there, man. Pea protein, pumpkin protein, and brown rice protein all in one, all organic sources. You know for sure that this pea protein doesn't have any glyphosate in there. A lot of pea proteins do, by yeah. the way. Y'all got to be conscious <laughs> about that. You know, mostly Sun Warrior proteins. I'm not even going to bash all these other brands okay I'm, what i'm gonna say is most plant-based protein companies have pea protein in there that's what it's gonna be but most pea protein 
has glyphosate in it. It is almost as widely grown of a crop as wheat is, and wheat is the most prevalent crop in the world with glyphosate on top of it, the pesticide. Well, pea protein is right behind it, if not right behind oats as well. But you can guarantee that anything Imperium does not have glyphosate in it because you know that the source is trusted. How? Well, we have the number one certified glyphosate detox in the world. It's the only one out there that exists in Biomedic. It is proven to reduce your C-reactive protein, an inflammatory marker, an inflammatory inflammation marker by six weeks and proven to, re to pull out glyphosate in your system by 75% in six weeks as well. So with the pea protein inside the MVP sport, you're not worried about pulling out any more glyphosate in there, number one. Number two, the biomedic is going to pull out any of the stuff that already may be in your bloodstream, number two. So going back to the MVP sport, pea protein, pumpkin protein, probiotics, enzymes, and adaptogens all in one in a very light vanilla flavored or chocolate flavored protein powder. I love making chia puddings out of that protein. I'll have a, a protein chia pudding. Nice. I love having that with a, a vanilla papaya protein shake. I'll get frozen papaya, mix that with some vanilla in there just so, for some more uh, protease enzyme from that papaya. And it's delicious. To me, it tastes like a, like a dreamsicle. I know most of y'all probably had a dreamsicle growing up, those frozen sticks, you know, those frozen pops, popsicle sticks. Um, and that's what it tastes like to me, the frozen papaya with the uh, uh, vanilla protein. And yeah, man, you're right. They're mostly horrible, chalky, and gritty. That is not the case with MVP Sport. Um, it's very light, digests very easy, not heavy on the stomach at all. Yeah, man, it's pure gas. Kwame, absolutely. Kwame, uh, pure gas, absolutely. And uh, then, Power Shake. Check this out. So, so, ancient Egyptians, right? Okay, so ancient Egypt was a vegetarian society. Vegetarian society. How were they vegetarian and they built the structures that they built? They were consuming wheatgrass every single day. By them consuming wheatgrass every single day, which is infused into the power shake, by the way, you are mimicking the hemoglobin of your blood. Okay, when you have wheatgrass every single day, it's basically like inoculating your cells with your exact blood type. Why? Because it mimics the hemoglobin of your blood. Wheatgrass, specifically. Before there was ever grass, though, in the world, the world had algae first. And one of the most famous algae in the world that exists is spirulina. Well, inside the power shake, you just so happen to have both spirulina and wheatgrass. So you are nourishing your cells with amino acids, phytoplankton, vitamins, minerals, carbohydrates, fats, all the above in an absorbable cell type delivery system via the power shake. And it's giving you power. It's giving you vitality. It's giving you endurance. When I have the power shake, I feel like I'm ready for the long haul. I feel like I'm ready to go ride my bike for four or five hours. I feel like I'm ready to go pump out a really good workout or nourish myself after a really good workout. And the thing about the power shake, guys, is it's like, it's so convenient, but you will never, ever, ever find as good of a tasting form of organic wheatgrass out there. Most people won't consume wheatgrass every single day. Why? Because their taste buds can't yeah. handle it. It's not necessarily the most palatable flavor when you're doing it. You go get a wheatgrass shot, it's going to be like, ooh. It's like grass. Oh. Yeah, literally. <laughs> <laughs> but the appleberry flavored power shake? Delicious. To me, it tastes like a, a green Jolly Rancher, in my opinion. Yeah. Um, it, apple, like, you know, a green apple, a little bit of berry there. To me, it tastes like a green Jolly Rancher. Now, I'm not having Jolly Rancher anymore, but I'm still getting that same flavor from the Power Shake. Yeah. Appreciate it, man. I mean, another important factor to weigh in is with inflation going on, all the costs of produce and grocery stores are going up. And, like, a lot of people, I feel like, aren't even eating the expensive organic produce because the price is continuing to inflate that they're starting to eat non-organic or genetically modified produce. And the fact that we get all of these ingredients and the price doesn't inflate like it does at the grocery store, you get the convenience and the time factor of not having to go out there and buy it and prepare it and clean it and cook it. You know, it's incredible. Like this is literally such a hack. Plus we get paid 
to be healthier and more convenient, you know, and to promote it and spread it to others. I mean, you know, you don't get paid to eat organic at the grocery store. The prices are going up. They're covered in pesticides. You know, even when things are organic, you know, they're covered in organic pesticides, insecticides, and herbicides. So it might not be glyphosate, but, you know, from what I've learned, if something's organic, they actually have to cover it in like four to five times as much because it's not as effective and not as strong and synthetic and chemical ridden. So there's stuff on everything you guys are consuming, unless you're growing it yourself or you're going straight to farmer's markets, which I know it's not as much of a convenience as it is here in Hawaii. A lot of other parts of the U.S. people live in cities and their stuff just go into grocery stores and rely on Whole Foods for the health and well-being of their family. When I love Whole Foods, but at the end of the day, it's, it's still a major corporation and there's negative influences and, you know, a lot of toxic things that are still in that space. So, Hey, is, is Jeff Bezos going to pay you to recommend any of uh, his Whole Foods products? No. No, nah, he's not. No, nah, he's not, he's not going to do that. He's not going to pay you. He's not going to pay me. He's not going to pay anybody. The CEO of Sprouts isn't going to pay you. The CEO of Trader Joe's isn't going to pay you. The CEO of Whole Foods isn't going to pay you. They're not going to pay you to recommend any of their supplements, number one. Number two, you don't know the nutrient density because you don't know the source, right? And number three, when you spend your money with them, you spend it one time and it's gone. Contrary to where when you're getting an organic source from a trusted – when you're getting organic foods from a trusted source who will pay you to from their advertisement budget – you're, you're recycling your money because you're putting your money into the marketplace and by you bringing in other people and sharing this, other pe sharing this with other people, they will pay you from the advertisement budget and you've now got your money working for you by recycling it, contrary to spending it one time and it's gone. And we're reducing the, the middleman, you know, there's no middleman, like the product doesn't have to go from the farmers to the shipping containers, transported in semi trucks to the facility and then having people stocking it and who knows how long it's been sitting and how long it actually took to get to those shelves whereas you know we're getting it sent straight from us straight from the farm from the company straight to the consumer you know and it re yep. removes the middleman which removes a lot of waste removes a lot of unnecessary energy usage remo removes a lot remember everything else is typically packaged in plastic so it removes a lot of the plastic and microplastics that ends up leaching onto your organic mm. produce so yeah mm. guys there, there's a lot that goes into it that's why like you know a lot of you know i've been into enagic for several years and enagic's been life-changing being able to take control of your water and have water that helps transport nutrients to your cells but the next step is what nutrients are you getting what nutrients am i transporting to my cells and where do they come from you know what are they packaged in what are they covered in when they're grown you know that's why this is such a game changer especially paired up with kong and water being able to consume mm. these shakes these supplements with the best water in the world now i have a true sense of security knowing that like i know what i'm drinking i know what i'm eating and you know, I can make one or two meals a day, which I'm ordering it from an online farmer's market here on island that I could order it. It's all the farmer's markets and I pick it up every Saturday. And, you know, when I am eating, I know the farmers. I'm getting it directly from farm to table in every aspect possible. So, yeah, Biomedic. Awesome, bro. This was hands down one of the products that I'm the most excited about. Cleansing glyphosate from my body, from my gut. Um I kind of posted about this, but I don't know if a lot of you saw it, but I grew up with some people in elementary school um, whose parents lived next to the Monsanto fields. Unfortunately, we're in Hawaii. You know, we're the most isolated place on planet Earth, which is the, a great place for the military to test a lot of weapons. It's a great place for Monsanto and Syngenta to test out a lot of their pesticides and GMO products. Um, because we're, we're the most isolated place in the world. They can get away with testing things and hiding things that they couldn't in the mainland. So, you know, one of my friends in elementary school I grew up with, her family, when, when they were pregnant, they were raised next to the Monsanto fields, which, you know, I live pretty close to it, but thankfully I was probably a couple more miles away. Like they live like right along the border of the Monsanto fields and there's a lot of dust and it gets really dry. And sometimes they're testing these pesticides and, you know, glyphosate herbicides and it gets onto the dust. Yeah. Yeah. I could hear you. Cool. Sorry about that. Go ahead. No worries. But yeah, so they're Monsanto is there testing glyphosate and herbicides on these produce and then once the the 
weather dries out, the dust, which is covered in the glyphosate, ends up blowing into the neighborhoods of all these local families. And the dust gets into their house, covers just their kitchen, covers their food. And my friend's parents, who were pregnant with her at the time, consumed a lot of this glyphosate, probably like a 10 to 100x more than the average person because they lived not right next to the field where the dust would blow. And this girl was born with like, no tube in her neck she had to have a machine connected to her neck to allow her to breathe and this was from kindergarten first grade second grade i remember all through elementary school i had classmates who had either breathing apparatuses because their bodies were just born with straight up defects or you know friends with faces that were twisted and deformed to the side and some of the craziest things that i don't think a lot of people really got to see that that I was raised with these people. I went to elementary school. They were in a lot of my classes from kindergarten, first, second, third, fourth, fifth grade, you know, people with full on deformities. And now, you know, a couple of years ago, I saw there's articles about how they're suing Monsanto and they're suing them because they're tracing these deformities, these birth defects to glyphosate being in their parents while they were pregnant with them. So, you know, that's scary. Like I'm seeing all my friends who are having children and they're consuming all these chemicals. You know, there's a lot of stuff on people removing breast implants. Breast explants are a thing now because people are realizing all the toxins and chemicals that they're putting right next to their heart and right next to their bloodstream. And, and most importantly, how it's affecting the next generation. Like this is chemical warfare and they're not necessarily coming for us. They're, they're attacking the next generation before they're even born when they don't even have a chance to defend themselves. So that's why, you know, this is a product I'm really passionate about because I've seen firsthand, I've seen for half a decade of my life growing up and being classmates with them, what this can do. You know, I'm pretty sure my friend Dana who had the breathing apparatus had to have like dozens of insane gnarly surgeries throughout her whole entire life just to stay alive. And these are the things we take for granted, being able to breathe properly, being able to even do a breath work. You know, some people were born without that ability. And that's because companies like Monsanto and products like glyphosate being in the bodies of the parents can directly affect their children when they're born. So, you know, this is insane. Like I'm seeing more friends having children than ever before and less of them cleansing their body of glyphosate. And to see another generation of kids born with birth defects the way I did here on Maui, just breaks my heart because these kids don't even have a chance to defend themselves. And a lot of the parents are so consumed in convenience, so consumed in other things and material gain and chasing clout on, on social media and trying to be famous that they forget that health is the most important thing and their health isn't even just about them. If you're becoming parents, your health is your priority because it also directly affects the health of your children and the youth that you offspring. So that's why this is something I saw that they're doing a call for pregnant moms, I think. And they're like David Sandoval is like having a call, like where it's inviting anyone who's pregnant and stuff like that. And I'm sh sure he's going to be going on talking about biomedic, but I don't think people realize how evil companies like Monsanto are. You know, even with my friends trying to sue them, I think Monsanto isn't even isn't even saying that they're they're not even pleading that they're pleading that they're gu not guilty. You know, like they're not even taking ownership or accountability over it when, you know, it's pretty much proven based on where they were located, like in vicinity, like it, it couldn't have been anything else. But Monsanto and glyphosate getting into the dust and getting into their parents bloodstream while they were pregnant with these kids. So. I'm just super thankful that my parents happened to move miles away from that neighborhood, but like it easily could have been me. You know, my face could have been deformed, my throat could be missing things, and I'd have machines in my body to keep me alive my whole entire life. And, you know, it's just something that everyone's got to be grateful for. And we got to really help prevent this from happening for the next generation. So, yeah. These products. Yeah, man. You know, the reason they're not admitting to it is because, you know, girls lie boys lie but numbers don't lie and the thing about numbers not lying is the fact that we have 80 percent of americans with glyphosate in their urine sorry in their urine and in their bloodstream and so you know the numbers don't lie when it comes to that look at it like this it's very simple unless you've been eating organic food your entire life you've probably been exposed to glyphosate in some way in some form and in some fashion and then based on the 
ability of or the the health state of your current gut bacteria your kidneys and your liver will determine as to whether or not you can process that through your body or not let's say you have a taxed liver or a taxed kidney and you can't process toxins through there as easily as somebody else maybe can or you have a an imbalanced gut bacteria well you're gonna have a hard time now dealing with this created um dam in your river it's very very simple right if you have um if you put a dam in the river the river stops flowing properly right well that's what glyphosate is glyphosate creates a dam in your river and so the biomedic removes the dam and it allows the river to flow properly it is the only only certified lab tested clinically studied clinically clinical trials proven to remove c-reactive protein an inflammatory marker by 74 percent in five weeks or six weeks and then remove glyphosate the actual toxin itself by 75 percent in six weeks as well six weeks of just taking that product wheat germ extract chicory root bur um not burdock root uh fulvic acid humic acid a couple other things that are in there as well but Dave Sandoval has created this product that has done absolute wonders to not just pull the toxin out of your system, but then rebuild that gut bacteria with other probiotics as well. My enroller, Ian Farrar, used to be gluten-free. Now he has gluten again. Well, how is that? Because it wasn't the gluten that was causing the problem in his system. It was the glyphosate on top of the gluten. Because wheat is the most prevalently sprayed pesticide or um, crop out there with pesticides on it, specifically Roundup, AKA glyphosate. So these pesticides guys, these parasites and these heavy metals are the real big problem. Those are the real problems causing a dam in your river. Those are why you're constipated. Those are why you're backed up. Those are why you're having brain fog. Those are why you're lacking energy and endurance. It's why your hormones are off. It's these little things. It's in the details. And they've snuck these little suckers in, <laughs> into our food. And we've been tricked into poisoning ourselves for convenience. Yeah. Well, Dave Sandoval has now created a way where we can conveniently nourish ourselves wherever we are. And one more point, going back to what you brought up earlier, organic deserts. Wherever we are, no matter where you are, I don't care if you live in an organic desert or not based on the foods you have available to you in the store, now you can do click, click, buy, ship it to your front door. You're not worried about living in an organic desert. My roommate is Navajo. He grew up on the res. He was telling me how Isaac, Isaac, you don't understand water yet fully, man. He's like, on the res, oh, water is so, 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 so sacred to us because we never know how much we're going to have. So sometimes we won't even use water to clean our dishes. Sometimes we'll use sand. And so he's talking to me about organic deserts, right? Well, the nearest uh, grocery store to them on the Navajo reservation was 12 miles away. You want to know what it was? Walmart. You, you want to how much of an organic of organic selection is available in Walmart? Not that much. Yeah. What's the nutrient density of that organic selection? Not that high. So his mom actually just now got the core four. She she actually just bought um half of the same amount of the same cleanse as you did. Um she got the core four plus cleanser because she understands that she lives way too far away from organic food availability. And she is also vegan and she wants to be able to nourish herself in a convenient manner, but not have to worry about where she's getting it from the nutrient density of all of it, all of that stuff. So organic deserts are a very, 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 very real thing. Imperium has bridged that gap between the consumer and the organic desert to deliver organic nutrition to your front door, number one. Number two, you would have to have six, I wanted to say this earlier, you would have to have six microgreen salads, six of them, to mimic the nutrient density of one serving of the power shake. That's a lot of fiber moving through your body. Six microgreen salads, that might take a little bit yeah. to even break that down and get that in and out the system. Well, one micro, one power shake is going to nourish you in the same manner, and it's going to be easy and allow that fiber to flow through you easily. Um, man, power shake is so, 
Oh, there's so much. Man, to I say can't about wait it. to take it after hours, this. Honest, yeah, yeah. <laughs> can't wait to take a first um, power shake. And yeah, this is for the parasite cleanse, guys. Super cleanse R. This is one I'm really excited to take. I mean, parasites are huge, especially with the amount of meat and you know people eating raw fish, people eating pork. Um, there's some nasty videos I've seen of the amount of parasites that could be in pork sometimes. And yeah, it's just it's scary, man, when you guys start to do your research and see that parasites are a real thing. And, you know, there's a lot of things that live on our body and unfortunately inside of us, too. And you'd want to try to do your best to support your body to fend them off because, yeah. Well, what's the trendy topic these days with, uh, you know, the conscious community? It's uh, it's it's breaking free from the Matrix, right? Yeah. Well, what's the first thing that Neo has to do for, for him to even consider be unplugged? He has to get the parasite that's in him out. Yeah. And they're like, look, Neo, either you do this or you get out the car. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So yeah. for us to really break free from the matrix, you got to kill the demon inside first. And a lot of this demon symbolism they're talking about in the Bible, and this is a whole other topic. I could talk about this another time. But a lot of this demon symbolism they're talking about in the Bible is really about parasites inside. Why? Because they control cravings drive thoughts, can control your emotions, and make you do things that you wouldn't normally consciously do. Here's the thing. We have 10 to the 1 amount of other bacteria living inside of our body and on, on top of and inside of our body than there is actual human cells. So what if a part of that 10 to the 1 was a bunch of other tapeworms that live off of a high-protein diet, high, pro high animal protein diet, high amount of processed starches and high sugars. Yep. That's what they eat. They, they love cane sugar. They love processed starches and they love, love animal proteins. Well, if you're addicted to those three things, you may have some parasites, but look y'all, it's a reality for everybody. We all grew up here. We were all raised in this society. We're all here. But again, for every problem out there that's created by man, nature has a solution. And our ancestors have been detoxifying parasites, tapeworms, and toxins via herbs and herbal compounds for thousands of years. This is alchemy. Super Cleansar is alchemy. It's getting the demon inside of you out. And you will be a different person, crave different things, be nourished easier when you're not trying to feed you plus 100. Yeah, because these things don't just get in there and stay there. They're like humans. They recreate too, and they repopulate and they move and they hide in corners and they're slick. <laughs> but they can be killed. They can be slayed. You can really slay these demons and you can really watch them leave and you can get your gut back. You can get your gut health back, get your energy back and get your normal natural cravings back. It's not natural for us to be craving a bunch of processed starches. Yeah. That's not a natural thing. What's natural is for us to be craving some, an apple getting ready to fall from a tree when it's ripe. That's what's most natural. Nature works very simply. It shows us when something is ready to be consumed based on its ripeness. That's the way nature works. But parasites will trick you into believing that you're hungry for something that you're not actually hungry for. The same way we have maybe parasitic politicians, you may have parasites inside of you as well. As above, so below, as within, so without. Yeah. So, yeah. <laughs> That's deep, man. No, I feel it. I mean, that was the topic of this live was herbicides and parasites. And these are two things that people overlook. And, you know, they do everything else to work out and try to eat healthier when, you know, they're feeding their parasites and they're still consuming herbicides, even while they're on a vegan diet or they're trying to eat healthier and live healthier. They do everything but, you know, some of the most important, valuable things. And yeah, it's important to realize that a lot of people's cravings, the sugar, corn syrup, starches, all of that stuff. I mean, that's why they're even trying to create this whole, you know, viral movement of fake meat because it's all starches and it's all sugars and it's all processed food, you know, and it's, it's just the weirdest thing ever, guys. I, I highly recommend watch the documentary Beyond Impossible. And you guys will see. I mean, a lot of it is pea protein. And as you were saying earlier, corn and pea is some of the most biggest monocrops that are covered in Roundup, covered in glyphosate out there. And that's pretty much why they're pushing this agenda of processed fake vegan meat, because that's a way for them to sell their 
you know, Roundup covered pea protein that they're creating in mass mm -hmm. amounts and importing from China even in a lot of cases. So, yeah, absolutely. Let me let me say this final thing about that real quick. The parasites uh, dodge the vegan hijack. You know, it's not going vegan is going vegan isn't the psyop. The psyop is inside of going vegan. Because everyone's, um, the, the elite are recognizing that everyone is waking up to the fact that fast food may not be the best thing for them. Consciousness is increasing whether they like it or not. They can't stop that. So what they're trying to do is be the gatekeeper and catch you trying to leave the gate. Oh, you're trying to be healthy now? Okay, cool. Well, we got this healthier option for you than the fast food, um, than the, than the uh, you know, animal fed cow that has cow disease that we've been feeding you through McDonald's. Okay, well now we're not gonna feed you mad cow disease via McDonald's anymore. Now we're gonna give you a Beyond Burger. This is better for you, says Kevin Hart. Says Kim Kardashian, says celebrities, right? <laughs> okay, 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 that, that's cool, that's cool. But that's the PSYOP. That's, that right there is where the PSYOP really is. Yeah. That's where the gatekeepers really are because that will keep your frequency low. It will keep your vibration low your ability to transmute thoughts, your ability to, to have clear thoughts, to have clear intentions to go about your day will be diminished because of pesticides, toxins, fungicides, herbicides, gums, fillers, all the other junk that comes in the vegan processed foods. Yeah. It's not going vegan that's the PSYOP. Going vegan is not the PSYOP. It's the processed foods inside of veganism that is the PSYOP, Beyond Burger, Impossible Meat. Two things that have tested very, very high for glyphosate. I'm not going to lie. I used to have Beyond Burger all the time, but that was before I was conscious enough to understand, overstand, and overcome my cravings for those type of textures. Why was I craving those types of textures? Because I had parasites in me before. But then when I did the ULT and I was consistent with that stuff, handled that and i'm not craving none of that stuff anymore i'm not craving those textures anymore i'm not i'm not like give me a burger anymore that's not me anymore now i'm like i want food that is going to serve me and put me on my highest vibration possible i want my food to have life in it because if my food has life in it it will give me life i'm here to create i am not here to consume we should be consuming to create not creating to consume yeah some people have it backwards but it's because not just because of who they are, but who they may have inside of them controlling some of their thoughts and cravings. Yeah, it's, I mean, I saw that, you know, Beyond Burger, all these companies, they're not even catering to vegans. They're catering to the omnivores that they are trying to get healthier. And that's why they don't even have the words vegan in any of their products. It's typically plant-based yeah. or made from plants or, you know, it's different wording that you guys will pick up on. But at the end of the day, read the ingredients. And if there's ingredients that you can't pronounce or you don't know how they were grown, like that's not something you should be eating. Like there are vegan burgers that are just nuts and seeds and sweet potato and things that are mashed into a patty. But, you know, I had a friend who worked for Beyond Burger and even as a chemist in the back of the lab, mixing the powders and oils, because that's really all it is, is canola oil, pea protein, and a bunch of starches and fillers even oh, the chemist, canola oil too yeah it's, it's all canola oil like and that's terrible as well guys that's probably covered in you know glyphosate as well but he was saying as a chemist who worked for beyond in one of their first factories on the east coast there were ingredients that the chemists didn't even know what they were the guys who made the burgers the guys Jeez. that were mixing the powders the fillers the oils there were some ingredients that they didn't even know what they were or where they could have came from you know, and that was the wow. same as you, man. I was hyped on Beyond Burgers when they first came out. And the second I started seeing Lit. Burger King come out with it, Cheesecake Factory having impossible, bur impossible Burgers, I knew something wasn't right. And intuitively, you know, I knew that wasn't the right move. I cut it out of my diet and I started feeling way better. Even cutting it out and just going to eating local source grass-fed meat, I mean, that made me feel way better than eating the ultra-processed you know, fake meat. And now I'm cutting that out mm -hmm. now and cleansing those parasites completely to where I don't even crave that meat anymore. But guys, like it, it just, it just, 
was sketchy, you know, the way that Beyond Burger launched, how fast it blew up, how fast food restaurants started taking it over. I mean, you know, that should be your biggest sign. The only healthy fast food out there is Perium, guys. It's convenient, it's fast, it's simple, and you know where it's coming from. And you can see the transparency of the founders and all the testimonies of all the people. You know, it's crazy the world we live in. You know, there's a lot of, a lot of corruption out there. And, you know, food is a direct way that they could do chemical warfare on humanity. So being able to mm -hmm. be more aware of not even just the water you're drinking. You know, a lot of people are still drinking fluoridated, chlorine filled, lead filled tap water, or they're drinking bottled water, which is pretty much tap water with microplastics and plastics into it. Yeah. So on top of water, which is 70% of your body, you know, this stuff is some of the most important things you could be taking and mixing and combining it together, along with supporting your local farms or starting your own farm and starting to really grow and eat your own food or meet the farmers and the people that are growing your food. So, yeah, thank you, Isaac, for dropping all that. Absolutely, off, man. man. Absolutely. Uh, one more thing real quick. Um, you know, talking about water, right? Well, here's one of the... Uh, crazy things about about Perium. Um, you're talking about you know fast food being the only fast food, good fast food available for you. That's correct. The reason being is because it's still raw. The enzymes are still intact. You know I've been raw now for 18 days. I haven't had cooked food in 18 days, and I've never been raw this long in my entire life. And my energy is through the roof. I feel amazing. Why is that? Because after my body gets a meal, it digests that meal, processes that meal into nutrient assimilation that it needs, it sends it wherever it needs to be, number one. Then my body goes into healing and cleaning mode. It's cleaning up toxins that I may have had built up throughout my entire life. Um, pesticides, heavy metals, vaccines, whatever it may be, whatever the source may be of how these toxins may come in, the body needs a chance to have a break from eating cooked foods so it can get into healing and cleaning mode. This is an organic, healing, cleaning, perfect, made in the image and likeness of God mechanism if you create the environment and give it the opportunity for it to be that. The saying goes, time heals all wounds, right? Yes, well, your body needs time to heal all those wounds. Otherwise, you will be working three times harder anytime you eat cooked foods trying, trying to digest any nutrient assimilation from that at all, then maybe getting, getting into cleaning and healing mode. So because all of Purium supplements are organic, pesticide-free, toxin-free, glyphosate-free, heavy metal-free, and raw, activated with water, here's what's happening when you're putting the power shake mixed in with the uh, Kangen alkaline water. You're then creating what's called H3O2. H2O doesn't nourish the body. We've been lied to about that. H3O2 is what hydrates the body. Where do you find H3O2? Inside of fruit. It is the water, the micro-clustered, structured water inside of fruit that hydrates you more than anything else in the world. Well, when you're getting an apple, right, and you're having a bite of an apple and you get that juicy texture, it's juicy because you're getting H3O2 from that apple. Well, guess what? You put some Kangen water inside of that apple berry shake again, guess what you're getting? H3O2, baby. You are nourishing your cells at a cellular level. Hey, tell yeah, me about baby. this oh, one yeah. too, man. I'm, I'm stoked to try this out. Fill me in on the cocoa hydrate. This is definitely one I'm a little less familiar with, but I'm excited I got some in the package. Well, yeah, man. I mean, it, I would put cocoa hydrate right up there with harm, Harmless Harvest uh, pink coconut water. I mean, the only difference is it's not in a plastic bottle. Yeah. Here's the thing. Um, um, I know a wise Rasta man out there who he doesn't drink any water at all, to be honest. Um, and he said, uh, because he gets all of his water from fruit, he's a pure fruititarian, guy's in his 80s, glowing skin, Rasta man. Yeah. Uh, but he recommends drinking a coconut water once a day. Why is that? Because when we shower, right, we're getting rid of dead skin in our body, right? Yes. But when you're drinking coconut water, it's basically like taking a shower for your insides. Yeah. Because it's so, um, it's so absorbable. The, the hydration is so absorbable. It's very similar to H3O2 when it comes to 
uh, the, the chemical and genetic makeup of H3O2. So it's going to nourish you and hydrate you more uh, than, than just having coconut water in a can out there at a store. Yeah. Because it's actual live active water, right? Again, reactivated. By the water the, the coconut water in the cans always sketched me out it's like the bpas and the chemicals and you know whatever lining they have and the aluminum and the cans it's you know not it's it's sad to see how much coconut water is being sold and drinking through these instead of through the coconut itself or through something like this which is plastic and aluminum and bpa free you know so yeah exactly. i'm excited to try this one out there's a couple more we got the aloe digest and the super xanthan Ooh. This one, I'm pretty, this one's similar to the cocoa hydrate, right? I heard you mix this one with the cocoa hydrate. No, 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 no. So that one is all enzymes. Okay. Oh, this is a digestive enzymes. Yeah. That one's all enzymes. That's enzymes, uh, probiotics, and a little bit of coconut, coconut base in there as well. Coconut uh, is the base of it, right? Plus enzymes, plus probiotics. Guys, enzymes are the key to health. Enzymes are the key to health. Enzymes will dige digest proteins for you that you have stored up in your lymphatic system. If you have proteins floating around your lymphatic system, trying to make their way out, but you have a weak lymphatic system, they'll never make their way out because there's not more uh, enzymes going on around you to try and get them out. Allo digest can help get those undigested proteins out. It can help get those undigested starches out. It can help get those undigested fats out. Most people have digestive issues because they're cooking their food, killing the enzymes, and they're not giving their body a synergistic chance to pull any nutrients from them. Yeah. Well, Allo Digest can build your enzymatic bank. We all have a bank, right? And we want to build our bank and stack that bank. Well, Allo Digest is going to build that enzymatic bank for you. I put Allo Digest in my uh, pre workout with the Can't Beat This. I put it in my power shake. I put it in my MVP. Anytime I'm making any supplement at all, Allo Digest is a part of it. Okay. Because I know that enzymes are the key. Enzymes are the key. You want the key to unlock your nutritional health? You need enzymes. Yeah. It's not about how much you consume, but how much you actually absorb and assimilate into your body. Yeah, that's Bingo. always been the key to it. And then this one I've heard some awesome things about as well. This is super xanthan. How's this stuff work? Yeah. Yeah, man. So it's spirulina. Um, I noticed very, the very... first ingredient is spirulina, and then there's astaxanthin. <laughs> I don't know how to pronounce it. Ast astaxanthin. Astaxanthin. Uh, it's one of the highest sources of antioxidants in the in the world. Um, and because, thank you so much, Emmett. Uh, because it, it's Emmett. one of the highest sources of uh, antioxidants in the world, it's going to be great for oxidative stress. Okay, so often. The body has a hard time recovering to go, at, go ahead and get back out there and do what you want to do and express yourself, right? That's what athletics is. That's what rollerblading is. It's what surfing is. You're going in and expressing yourself in some way, right? Yeah. Well, oxidative stress is going to hold you back from having the limber ability to go out and do that again. Well, astaxanthin is going to send antioxidants to the oxidative stress area and get rid of that oxidative stress. It's going to get rid of inflammation, and it's also, I forget exactly what it is, something about zeaxanthin, one um, a molecule inside of astaxanthin, uh, but it's also good for your eyesight. Yeah, one thing that it says is provides protection from, for the skin from UVA and UVB damage, which has really, really caught my attention. It's like the fact that it helps repair from sun damage and stuff like that. You know, something everyone needs, especially this time of the year when it's like 120 degrees out there in Arizona. Absolutely, bro. It, I mean, dude, it goes back to that thing of wh what did we have before we had grass and trees and all that stuff? We had algae. Yeah. Algae is the oldest form of food that we have in this planet. And astaxanthin is one of those oldest forms. And us plugging into what the ocean has to offer is a hidden I mean look key. at look at whales you know humpback whales are vegetarian they're some of the biggest creatures especially the blue whale is the biggest creature on the planet and it eats algae it's all it eats phytoplankton and algae and you know that's literally just the craziest thing you know that we can start to consume what they consume so for all you athletes out there who they have a very hard time with recovery 
I don't know of a product that will help you recover faster than Super Xanthan. If I knew of one, I'd be taking it. I'd be repping it and recommending it. But I don't know of one. This is currently the best thing I know of in the marketplace. And that's why I rep it. That's why I consume it. I, but I wouldn't represent anything that I don't consume as well. And I'm very transparent for those of you who don't know me on social media or whatever. I'm very transparent. I try to show you all everything that I have and show you all my lifestyle, show you all my body, not to try and show off or whatever, not to impress anybody, but to impress upon you that these, this is the power of superfoods. Yeah. This is the power of what Mother Nature has to provide. When we choose to respect her for what she offers to us freely, if we just protect her, love her, and care for her like she asks, because the mother is abundant. The mother wants for us to eat. The mother wants for us to consume and to create. And she will give us everything that we need to consume to go and create more and express ourselves more and live the life that we are designed to live more if we protect her, love her, water her, and care for her the way that she asks. We don't have to take a cow's life. You don't have to take a sentient being's life like a pig, a sentient being's like a chicken's, like a chicken's life. You don't have to take these beings' lives to go and experience. We can get all of these things from nature. Now, I'm not trying to tell everybody on this live to go vegan, by the way. Everyone is at their own stage of consciousness and experience and, and ability and, and what you want to do. It, it was a process for me. It took me about a year and a half for me to make the decision. And then about a year and a half after that for me to be making the decision the correct way and actually going vegan the right way which what i found was an organic whole food whole food plant-based diet whole foods because you want whole foods because it's the way nature intended for it to be consumed beyond burger is not whole foods okay but you could go and get a black bean mushroom burger with oat flour and that is whole foods why because it's the it's the whole it's the whole food there's not a bunch of processed foods on yeah. it <laughs> fillers and junk and oils and whole foods yeah whole Those foods and superfoods yeah whether you're going vegan or not everyone just needs to be eating more whole foods more superfoods and less plastic and less glyphosate you know that's literally all that Absolutely. needs to happen and then just trust your body throughout the process and yeah the final product i know this has been a long live i mean this has been an incredible transformation kit and thank you so much isaac for really just deep diving with me i've learned so much and i'm super excited to commit to this 30-day cleanse and full-on lifestyle change for the rest of my life you know this isn't just some diet this isn't just some one-time 30-day thing it's taking this cleanse and then staying on the core four and staying on a lot of these products for a long time coming like I was telling you guys, it's a transfer of dollars of money that was being spent eating out from someone else or going to the grocery store and having to search through all the foods and wash them all myself and cook it and all the time. I mean, the convenience factor is huge, you know, and especially with so in much. inflating prices, it costs more money and gas to even go shopping to buy groceries that are getting more expensive. And unfortunately, the quality isn't getting any better it's probably getting worse because even these farmers and everyone else are having to deal with these inflating prices At the end of the day it's a business to a lot of them so you know they'll cover it with whatever they need to to protect their assets so it's hard to really know unless you know the farmers or know the owners like david sandoval i mean you know it, it's never been more important for you guys to take advantage of a company like Perium. i know it's time for me i mean how, how long has Perium even been around it's like 20 30 years old right um, no, it's actually just under 20 years old. Okay. So my enroller, Ian Farrar, recruited the company, which is funny because most people get recruited by a company, right? Well, Ian recruited Perium to be a direct sales company. They were, um, Ian's asking me how to get on. I don't know if he's able to at all. Um, I don't know if you could possibly write him back at all, Darren. I'm um, yeah. just trying to come on here somehow. But um, Ian, and maybe he'll tell this story, Ian recruited Dave Sandoval into turn into taking their products literally out of Whole Foods. They were literally in Whole Foods. Okay. Ian recruited Dave to take the products out of Whole Foods and go from a, you know, normal product on a shelf to being a person to person recommended direct sales business. And so um, Purium has been in business only about uh, 19 years now. And what was the question before that? Sorry, I got a little distracted by bringing up Ian. Oh, I was just asking how, how long has Perium been around? And I actually just invited Ian to come on. What's up, bro? 
Awesome, hey, there he is. Got invited onto a live. Blessings, okay. can, I, can I talk to you tomorrow? Okay, <laughs> blessings, nice yeah, to see you. Yeah. Perfect timing. Hold brother. up, hold up. I want y'all to know who Ian is. Let me introduce this guy real quick before he starts talking. I want y'all to know who this guy is. So this is the founding brand partner of Perium, okay? He's literally the founding brand partner, the guy that recruited the company. He's a gold medal cyclist, okay? Uh, he's in his 50s. He hikes, he, he cycles up the like highest mountain in Medellin, Colombia, almost every day in Colombia. He just got back from, from US. He's in his 50s, able to cycle up that, still in his 50s, looks like he's in his 30s, and he has a plant based um, degree from Cornell here. University. So the guy is walking the walk. Yeah, he's a really fired up guy, but he's walking the walk, and that's why he deserves the edification that I just gave him. So that y'all understand that he's, it's his lifestyle. He is a plant-based athlete that's not just talking about it, but living it. So Ian, bro, if you don't mind real quick, man, tell us real quick how you recruited Perium. <laughs> oh, hey, it's thank a you again, brother. We just went uh, through all the products and yeah, it's an honor to have you on, man. Hey. Love for you to share your story. Darren, I, I've been waiting for this day. We've been talking back and forth when I was in South America. Blessings to you. I'm so happy and I'm exhilarated of the amazing experience that you're going to have. You know, well, listen, it, it goes back 20 plus years when I was really disenfranchised with what was available to me in the network marketing space. You know, the biggies, you know, I don't need to name the names, but the products were just like in the back seat. The opportunity was in the front seat. And I said, you know what? I'm going to find the right people to align myself with to make the best certified organic superfoods and then bringing them in the, in the network marketing space. That was, that was 19 years ago. The September 25th is my 19th year anniversary. And you know what? It's bliss. Every day I get to share the best of the best with people, elevate them, and offer a $50 gift card where they could really invest in their health where the wealth is. Mm. Yep. Mm. You know, so, so for me, you know, it's like I've been in the direct selling network marketing space for 26 years. And, you know, I was a full time athlete when network marketing bumped into me. I just wanted freedom. It wasn't about 10,000 a month, 20,000 a month, 30,000 a month. It just was the ability to just go out and train and not have to work a job or a catering job or this or that. You know, so for me, I mean, hands down, I mean, the ultimate lifestyle transformation plus performance that you have, Darren is truly a blessing i mean no 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 corners cut certified organic verified non-gmo project and the packaging that he you just broke up ian can't hear you oh yeah your audio just cut out ian no audio no audio but i get what you're saying your the packaging is the bamboo hemp Plastic free something, compostable something packaging. Something happened with the audio, Ian. Sorry. Yeah, your audio disappeared right when you're going into the packaging. This is awesome, though. I didn't know we could have so many people on a Facebook Live like this. It's actually the first me time either. I've done it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, me too. Yeah. Now we can. Now we can. Go ahead. All right, good. Hey, you know. Ian, 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 real quick, explain yeah. what you were explaining, okay? And then the final product that we were going over is apothecary. So finish your story, what you were explaining. Okay. And then if you don't mind, explain the apothecary after that. Yeah. That was the final just, product just, we were covering in the package. Yeah, just to let everyone know, okay, Purium is up to close to 200,000 pounds of less plastic that we've introduced into the environment. What network marketing company is actually doing that to really help the planet? So you know what? I'm behind that. I know Darren's behind that. I know Isaac's behind that. But getting into the apothecary, if people want restful sleep, most people are lacking naturally occurring melatonin, okay? So this is the only cherry species of its kind that has naturally occurring melatonin. It's going to give the body the equivalent of nine servings of fruit. It's an anti-inflammatory. We're talking like an amazing superfood cocktail just by itself. And it has three, phyto comp three phytonutrient compounds that are lethal to cancer cells. I didn't say it, Perium didn't say it, just Google Mount Marinci Tart Cherries and its anti-cancer effects.
Mm, yeah, I had to crack into the box early last night to take some before bed because, yeah, I knew that it was a must-have before sleep. Dude, listen, I'm, I'm like, I'm sending you the FedEx, like, tracking, and I'm, I'm so happy it got there in a timely manner. And I'm telling you, it's like superfood utopia. I mean, with amazing opportunity behind it because there's no shortage of people that eat. There's no shortage of people with a compromised microbiome. I mean, everyone needs Biomedic with the glyphosate that's proliferated our food supply. Bam. Yeah. Yeah, Damn. no, we're super excited, man. Thank you so much for tapping in. And yeah, I mean, this is just the beginning. I, I started my day. I already took the biomedic, took my super aminos. I'm about to make my first power shake and really keep everyone on my Facebook and social media in the loop with the entire process. But, you know, I That's think great. someone said it best. Emmett was in the comments saying, you know, we both look super healthy. And I'd say you look incredible as well, man. I mean, no one would ever guess you're in your 50s. You know, I'd say they think that we could all be in our 20s right now you know so it's Listen, incredible it's, it's called it's, it's called epigenetics okay and epigenetics is doing things on a daily basis to keep your cells young and vital okay and and epigenius epigenius kids it's a product that we developed for children because the children today unfortunately are not going to live as old as adults because of what's going on with the food so you could change your epigenetics okay what you are what you eat okay and what you eat on a daily basis determines your human optimization outcome yeah mm. i can talk all day guys I'm a <laughs> <laughs> hey well it's a pleasure having you on Ian, yeah thank really. you for tapping in we'll do this more often and i'm gonna be keeping people in the loop documenting my journey but this is just day one and yeah i couldn't be more excited man thank you both so much for putting me on and yeah excited Blessings, to meet Garrett. up again it's soon it's I, I love what you're all about and just keep this, you know, day by day. I'm telling everybody to check in with you because, you know, it's all about taking people's health and life to the next level. And we could cover all those bases. Yeah. So I guess to kind of close this off, you know, anyone who'd watched it live or is catching up and watching the recording. I mean, you know, what's the best first step you recommend? You know, we got these gift cards we can give out to people and help them yeah. get a discount on their first order. And yeah. you know, if any of you guys like what you saw and you want to try one of these products, try out a cleanse and do the cleanse with me, um, you know, do the cleanse with us. I mean, definitely hit us up, reach out to myself, Isaac or Ian. And yeah, we got promo codes. We got gift cards we can give out to you guys. And yeah, give you guys the hookup so you can try these yeah. out. Definitely get some Biomedic, get some Power Shakes. You know, there's a lot of products that you guys and just listen, have to try it yourself. Yeah, and if someone wants to come on board with the Ultimate Lifestyle Transformation Plus Performance, you're going to get $100 off with that gift card code. That is a miraculous deal, okay? If someone yeah, just guys. wants, you know, yeah. So the thing is, it's win-win all the way around. We're here to help you. I'm a certified and plant-based nutrition, so I can help you on your nutritional front as well as other aspects as well. Yeah. And remember, guys, it's a transfer of dollars. You know, this was a no brainer because otherwise I'd be struggling to figure out where to spend my money to eat food that's not even nearly as close as healthy, sustainably packaged, glyphosate free, you know, let alone with inflation. The cost of all this unhealthy garbage around us is actually going up in price, plus the gas prices that even get out to the store. The fact that this just came to my house yesterday and I have all of it ready that I have this convenience, you know, for the next month, like I, I'm so excited. And that's why I'm going to be spending a lot more time sharing the journey and educating you guys on why that I decided to make this leap of faith. So yeah, guys, thank you so much for tapping in, watching the live, watching the recording, and you'll definitely be hearing more from myself, Ian and Isaac. So appreciate you Excellent. guys. Mind if I say one more thing, Darren? Of course, brother, go ahead. So, so yeah, guys, for everyone curious, anyone who spends $75 or more, Okay, reach back to Darren. Anyone who wants to spend $75 or more on product, Darren's gift card will give you a $50 gift card off of that. If you get the core four, okay, the core four is going to be the staple, which Darren mentioned that he's going to be on after the ultimate lifestyle transformation. Why? Because it's the core four. It's the staple of your nutrition. The biomedic is going to continually pull out toxins from your system while building your gut bacteria. The power shake is going to nourish your cells with the wheatgrass and spirulina that I already went through. The super amino 23 is going to be dotting all your, all your eyes and crossing your T's for your amino acid necessities, giving you clean plant protein straight to your muscles in 23 minutes. And then the apothecary is going to come through with that melatonin equaling HGH, human growth hormones, so you can recover faster than you ever have and get deeper rest and vitality so that you wake up with energy. 
You'll get uh, 25% off of a core four with Darren's code. You'll get 25% off of the ultimate lifestyle transformation with Darren's code. Yeah. The ultimate lifestyle transformation is basically two core fours plus the parasite cleanse, super cleanse are. Well, Darren didn't just get the ultimate lifestyle transformation. He got the ultimate lifestyle transformation plus performance, which is all the athletic products as well. The MVP, the can't beat this, the cocoa hydrate, and the super xanthan. That's the top package available. You can get 25% off of that, $100 off of that with Darren's code. Do this code with him. Remove the dam from your, from your river and get your river flowing again properly, guys. That's all these toxins and these parasites, and that's all they do is they create a dam in our river. Remove the dam. Allow your river to flow properly again. Lock arms with winners who are determined to win, right? Darren's a winner. I've seen Darren win in multiple businesses and multiple avenues the entirety that I've known him. Now that he's locked arms with us, Imperium, I see him leading a massive wave of other leaders who are going to win and lead people towards organic, plant-based nutrition, not just spending their money on organic plant-based nutrition one time though, but instead having their money work for them and recycling their money. You go to Whole Foods, you go to Amazon.com, you go spend money elsewhere. Okay, you can buy that and you can get good nutrition. But what's the source, number one? Number two, that money's gone. Here, you are recycling your money. So I just had to say that one last thing, guys. Get back with Darren. He's the guy who really put all this together here. And uh, we, myself, Ian and Darren will be here for support for all of you. Darren, thanks for having me on, brother. Appreciate you guys. Yeah. Remember, Thank health you so is your greatest wealth. Health is your greatest wealth, and an investment in yourself will always pay the best interest. And I'm hyped. I haven't even taken or opened my Can't Beat This yet, so definitely stay tuned for the progress. See awesome, you guys man. soon. Blessings. Blessings. Peace out, y'all. Later, Ian. Later, Isaac. All right.